In this video, you will learn how you can remove conditional formatting in Excel. And this is very important because sometimes you put in the condition and maybe now after a while you, you figure it out that this is not the right thing or you just want to remove it. So let me show you exactly how and let me tell you here what, what, we are see, what you're seeing. Now this is our Baker's Recipe Costing Calculator dashboard and in here, this is one of our other videos, we have added a conditional formatting. As you can see here, we have this conditional formatting and once we select a different cake brand, you can see the design is coming up. And maybe after a while you figure out, well, this is nice, but this is not suitable for for some reason. Perhaps you don't want this, so you want something else. How can you remove this? Well, let me show you a very quick way. First of all, you select the cell where you have the conditional formatting. And once you did that, you just click on this. You can see all these options here. And you can see here, if you scroll, for if you go down here to clear rules, you can clear the rules for the selected cell or from the entire sheet. So in this case, the entire tab. So let's clear for the selected cell only. Once we did that, as you can see, now the conditional formatting has been disappeared. And if we adjust this, there is no conditional formatting anymore. So what will happen if you would, for example, have multiple, maybe you have an entire column here. Let's put in a conditional formatting for entire column. We select them all. We're going to put in here a, uh, we will put in a new rule. We can select tier one, let's say here, top 10. What do we have here? Icon set, which is uh, quite common. All right, so you can see here we have this. If we just only remove one item, for example, we just want to remove these because this is not, this is just the costing of the product. And it should not show any price and it doesn't make any sense. So we select this, click on that, clear the rule for the selected cells. There you are. So now you can see the conditional formatting is only down here. If we want to, for example, we select this, we do the conditional formatting, clear rules, clear rules from entire sheet, click on that. And there you are. Now you can see instantly all the conditional formatting has been removed. And this is basically how you can remove conditional formatting in Excel from a template. And this is only for this sheet. So once we are on the other sheet, for example, here are our ingredients, nothing happens. To show you that, let's select this and we give this a conditional formatting. We're going to give this an icon. All right, and then we go back here. And here we have a conditional formatting as well. And we say here also another icon set. All right, we select this. Conditional formatting, clear rules for the entire sheet. There you are. And then we go here, you can see nothing has happened here. And let's clear these out as well for the entire sheet or in the selected cells. There you are. This is how you can remove conditional formatting for specific cells and for an entire column or for an entire tab or for a, a entire sheet. So if you like videos like this, quick and easy Excel videos, subscribe to my channel. If you struggle with this, just post a comment below and maybe you have an idea, but you're trying to figure out how you can do it in Excel. Post them in the comment section as well with your idea and I'll try to reply back and try to make a video of the item you're looking for. 